a two meter kit which I brought from Australia. I actually bought it before I got my license and was assembling it. And the minute I got the license, I went to Bob and it I, I didn't work. So he said, look, there are so many dry, sold, dry joints in this that he nicknamed me Mr. Dry Solder. Because <laughs> was so, I thought it was such a mess I had made of that uh, two meter ring. But got it working and uh, almost the first day after I got my license with his help and uh, we went physically, I went physically on top of a friend's house, pulled down his antenna and cable, brought it, put it on my house and I was on the air the next morning itself. Sorry? Echo Victor. Echo Victor. He, was there. he didn't even know. He was not there. So I, before he knew it, I had taken away his antenna and cable and was on there. Uh, they mentioned about uh, ARSI and Lebanon Life membership. Our main work is to try and do as much as we can to improve the facilities as far as we can for AMS in India. It is uh, not like a club which is there to promote amateur radio locally. Our job is quite different. It is uh, something which we have to do with the government. It's a thankless job because our rules and regulations go back to the 1700s and nobody bothers to change it. There are many uh, requirements for getting a license which are completely unnecessary now but the government does not budge. So that is a major problem for us and we are doing it. We have managed to get some things done. Frequency allocation has been improved considerably. So I hope you have a very nice meet here and uh, I'm looking forward to meeting with all of you and uh, having a uh, conversation and talking about amateur radio which I have been done for a very long time. So all the very best and good morning. So I think uh, that's for the day. If anybody would like to speak, they are most welcome. Anybody would like to come to that? You want to try? Yeah, we have got the Kusum Baba, who was once very active, and this has been active for a long time. This, uh, he's wheel free as PQ, was very active, now an actor. So it would be great if he comes back. Yeah, it would be great if he comes back to the army. So I found that too. Thanks, Manny. I think, you know, it's been... Everyone who has spoken, we have forgot something like, good morning, old man, and miles. We have moved to the world, gentlemen. That's the exact point from which, honestly speaking, I have come here to speak to you all as an opportunity. Yeah, he said, right. I've been very active, chasing VXS, part of Fox 10, Boston, MP Mark 5, the element drive under HPS. Trust me, I have given away all of my equipment. I probably carry uh, two VHF. The only way the ham is active around me now is with the ELR and BBB. They know they've been my team for the last almost now six years plus. So that's how the ham still is live in my office. But honestly speaking, there is no way that I could have. Uh, you know, being active on the radio. Having said, it's not that I have picked up another hobby. I have picked up flying as my hobby. I have been a pilot now for some time. And I fly almost every weekend. Every Saturday I fly. And of course, I got my RT clearance in uh, uh, flying just over one attempt. That's because of ham radio. But the day I started flying, the traffic controller started asking me, uh, how I was able to well speak on the radio because student pilot licenses generally have this problem. The question that I'm trying to bring you all here is, I've seen internet world much big way. We run one of the largest broadband companies in the country in Hyderabad. It's known as Beam Tele. Yeah. The, the angle, the, the, see, now this is very slow. Okay, and this side, so, 
even if you want to change the band. Yeah. Uh -huh. So there is no band switch. This is not actually required. Okay, one. Then I've combined this with this. You press this once. See that. Good. Great. So nice. Linear. Okay. Then you press it twice. Sorry. Yes, you got more to change. No, 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 not that. That if you press it, B, B has come out. Yes, sir. B has come out. Yeah, then if you do, just keep it pressed. Again, B will come to the same thing. Yes, 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 yes. So, you've got B and B. Yes, sir. You've got great. So, just one switch. So, the second thing is, while it's standing like this, if you see a good station, just press it in. After that time, it will stop. So, what I do is, what's happening on the band, from 14, 180, I just put it there and sit back. If I see a thing, I just press. And it stops there. I use the Arduino also to generate the side tone. In each variety, I put five numbers. Five numbers. When you are a pakka ham. You got a 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 ham. I know. That's what I know. I just talk. You're not going to school keeper. You're going to put your talk. What are you? One day. Mio tri eco di Maro mio. Come, come, come.